So, Norman Butter, uh, did you believe uh, at the beginning of last year that this year you would be riding in a World Tour team? No, absolutely not. My biggest aim was uh, Pro Continental and uh, I didn't hope that this uh, season would be so good and uh, it was uh, many big surprises in the end. Did you have some other offers or was this the only one? Uh, I had a lot of Continentals and uh, my coach uh, René talked with uh, Jell Karstrom with director of uh, cycling academy and uh, it was like in the summer already they talked but uh, he wasn't sure and then uh, I got uh, another offer from uh, Wallonie Bruxelles and I, uh, I'm, I was told that uh, they are uh, can't uh, sign now because they need uh, all the Katyusha riders to be sure but uh, then I was like uh, I bought the plane tickets to Brussels and uh, Jell was uh, like uh, under pressure <laughs> and uh, I lost my plane tickets and I got the contract right away that's a pretty good thing I think <laughs> yeah uh, but uh, can you tell me about your winter preparation uh, at this moment and are you happy with your form uh, and is everything going to plan and also last year you had Rene coaching you uh, who's coaching you now uh, winter has been good in the first week uh, so I was in Estonia uh, I was like month I did uh, in Estonia I started 23rd October, I came to Spain 23rd November and uh, then the real work started and uh, then I go, went my, with my team to training camps till the 18th of December. I got a little bit ill in the Christmas so it wasn't so perfect. But uh, now I'm over it and uh, I have uh, happy, happy with my condition right now and my coach is uh, Greg Henderson now. Are you happy with your team too? Have you chilled together? Are the teammates nice and everything is going according to plan? Yeah, in the team camp we were two weeks together and uh, I got to know not everybody but some nice dudes and uh, I didn't see any like bad aspects, everybody was friendly and uh, I think I will be happy. When's your first race? My first race is 26th January in uh, Argentina to the San Juan. Your former coach uh, René Mandri told that you're definitely uh, a really good rider for the Cowboy Classics. Would you be at the start of the Paris Bay this year? Uh, I think not. I was told that I'm gonna do semi classics. Like, I think my first classic is Knocker of course. Then I can try cobbles, but I don't have uh, really nice memories from the juniors Paris Roubaix. Okay. And did you talk with your team like? Will you get some options to go for the win in some races or still this first year is for development of your uh, bike? It's both for development but uh, I can get my own chances as well. We're in Tirona at the moment and a lot of uh, Estonian professionals live here and a lot of other professionals live here too. Are you going to move here too or somewhere, somewhere else in, in Europe? Uh, actually, I'm not sure right now because the uh, calendar is so uh, so busy and uh, I don't know uh, if I'm going to uh, like do it temporary or not. I will see about that. So, if you got the flat in Girona.
<laughs> okay. And last year you rode for cycling uh, Tartu team and you got those wins that uh, pretty much those wins took you to a pro contract. Uh, and now this team uh, went continental too with a U23 team. What do you think of that team? Uh, it was a perfect team for me because uh, this uh, team's calendar was like uh, meant to be like that. I could get the wins. So every race, uh, Rene like uh, talked uh, maybe Norman can win there. So it was like basically a team for me. <laughs> But uh, yeah, I'm super thankful for that. And also, uh, I have to thank our national team too because we got uh, many UCI races as well with national team. Okay. This year you have a really busy calendar, as you told. But are you still gonna race some races in Estonia? The nationals? Uh, nationals, definitely. And uh, maybe a tour of Estonia, maybe with national team, maybe with uh, real team. Okay, super. But yeah, thank you. Best of luck for your season. Thank you.